G'day ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel and if you're new here, how's it going? Thanks for joining us on this PGA Tour 2K21 course playthrough. Okay, so today's course we have Aspen Villa Short Course and this is designed by Mayday91283, I've played quite a few of his courses, very good designer and this is his entry into the Victory Lynn Sports Par 3 Perfection Contest. Now, I don't know much about this contest, but I know it's all par 3 courses. And, well, who doesn't love a um, good par 3 course? 18 chances to get a hole in one. So, I might find out a little bit more about this um, contest and see if we can put a few more courses on the channel. Um, Alright, let's get into today's settings. Uh, what have we got? The winds are default. Fairways are soft. The greens are firm. Green speed is meeting the fast. Time of day is afternoon. The weather is overcast. And we will be playing from the tips, which are the blue tees, measuring 3,000... 120 yards on pin set one. All right, that's enough of the business. Yeah, let's get out there and see if we can nail some hole in ones. Okay, here we are out on the course. So let's um, go and rip up the camera and see what we can see. Oh, he's got a nice little clubhouse down here. <laughs> got the practice greens, check out this. The goats have taken over that green. So yeah, old um, Mayday is a part of the Dirty Ankle Mafia Society, or the damned um, design society also there's a moose and there should be a cow now we're old baby bull that has recently or he joined a little while ago now got accepted into or got asked to join the dirty ankle mafia yeah wow what a beautiful setting look at the view from up here as well the man puts in so much work into his course you got all that was it like a um i don't know if it's like an industrial estate kind of looks like it from here because you got the smokestacks on that building down in the distance and it's just like kind of like a White House building down there as well. We'll get down there and have a look at that in a second, but I just want to sort of just zoom down through here. I've seen all this beautiful planting that he does. Absolutely gorgeous. What a nice setting for this course. I love the colours of the trees, the old autumn theme. Yeah, all par threes. But yeah, it should be, it should be a good fun day. Or a good fun round anyway. What a grass. Man, he's done some grass work. I wonder if all that is planted individually. I reckon it would be. I just sort of wander down through here as well. Just have a look off this screen. You can see the kind of view that you'd be getting down here on the green. Absolutely stunning. Alright, so the course plays out around this way a bit more. Yep. So let's just go for a quick little wander up this way that we can see. He's done an absolutely beautiful job of this. Very nice. More of the course down through here, you got all that just the thick trees. Uh, let's um let's go for a quick wander over here because he God he put some detail in his courses. Absolutely brilliant. What is this? Is this like a... I don't know, to me it almost looks like a White House building. Now I haven't gone over to the um, course thread to have a read. I've just seen this on Twitter and I thought, eh, why not? Let's go and hit it. That was a bit um, spontaneous. There's the uh, smoked stacks there. Got the old NFL football ground as well. Very nice. All the houses up in the distance there. Let me pan the camera around now. He's got this bridge. I did notice out the corner of my eye. Hey, look at that. Nice. Look at that big bridge down here. I've never seen a bridge made like that before. Oh, very nice. Um, let's get back to the course, which is around this way. Have a quick little scoot around here. So it plays all up on the hill. So yeah, we're going to get a good view of the um, town down there that he's put in. Very, very nice. All right, well, let's get back to the first tee, and I think we shall start swinging. Uh, all right, what do we got? Hole one, par three. Okay, 100 and, uh, what do we got? 103 yards, uh, four feet up. So, yeah, should be, should be a nice little short video, being par three and all. We got 104, yeah, sand wedge. Yeah, not too bad. Might even just give it a little bit of low loft, just to punch through that wind a bit. Probably a little bit too much there. Let's see what we can do with this. Oh, slight little fast, so that is going to be definitely left of the pin. 
Oh, distance was almost spot on. Oh, a nice little tapping bird here. The green space today, 157s. Got a night, that nice setting too. It's got that. So he's got that overcast look and like that, uh, the, like the fog or just the mist down in the distance. It's very nice. Um, all right, hole two. Uh, what have we got here? 199 yards, 23 feet down. All right, 23 feet down. So it's not that back. A couple of clubs here. I might take out yeah, the old five iron here. This will probably roll in nicely. Beautiful line of sight off the tee. I reckon every one of these holes will. One more wind coming at me. So we can bend it around here a bit to the towards the hole. Oh, got under that with a perfect. Now this should bounce nicely and turn towards the right here. Slightly, oh, just a little, a little too far out to the left on that one. Oh, get off, get off, get off. Ah, oh, no, that's going to make me part. All right, let's do it. Now what do we got here? 17 feet. Nice, gentle little break. Oh, boy, yeah, there it is. Birdie number two. I think we can score like 1,800 or something like that, if not better, if we nail a hole in one. Um, all right, hole three. Uh, what do we got here? 142 yards, 14 feet down again. Beautiful view off the tee. 14 feet down. A little bit of five mile breeze pushing us out to the right here. Well, we do have the we do have this slope right there. We're funneling it back towards the hole. We do want to get up on the green here. Six mile winds. Coming in with the nine iron. Okay, we're going to do this with the nine. Six mile winds. Put it about there. Put some high loft on it. Give it a fair bit of backspin. Move that out a little bit more for that wind. Oh, that was fast. That is staying out to the left. What a view, though. What a view from up here on this green. Oh, wow, look at that. Look at that planting. That's a nice angle of that. Shows it off beautifully. Okay, what do we got here? Hundred oh sorry, hundred and thirty one. <laughs> That'll be a massive putt. Uh thirty one feet. That is oh, slight up to downhill. Nasty putt these ones. Especially when you got that nasty red slope at the back. Oh, is it going to trickle down? Oh, come on. That had the line and everything. Just didn't have the juice. Okay. A two under after three. That's not what we're here for. We're just here to check it out. Because oh, I love a good par three course. I really do. Nice and short. Good fun course. All right. Uh, what do we got here? 257 yards. Four feet down for the fourth hole. It's sort of a bit of a... Line tee shot there with the with the grass and everything. I should have brought a shorter driver, or I need a three wood. <laughs> Definitely need a three wood, I think. So, um, what can I do with this driver? Can I take power out of it, like a lot? Maybe put some low loft on it. That'll keep it low. Take a bit of distance out of it. Take some power out and see what I can do. Oh, massive red fast, but we're coming in hot. And that's what we want. We want it to get up and roll. Come on, start turning around to the right. Oh, is it going to catch the slope? Oh, we got it. Got the slope. Look at this. That flag comes into the frame. I'm damn happy. Holy shit, here it is. <laughs> what a shot. Partial driver. Hell yes. I am damn happy with that drive, even though it was a massive red fast. Alright, let's move on to hole five. Part three. <laughs> okay. 
Uh, what are we looking at here? 158 yards, 9 feet up. With a full mile breeze, it's going to give us a nice little push. Coming in with the 8. Well, this might not be too bad. A little bit of high loft on this, I think. Maybe not. Oh, just, just a tad. Just a tad. Oh, slight little fast again. I need to slow that thumb down. That's it now. Drop down. Not too bad. Okay. Oh, that almost looks almost looks like a straight putt to me. Just got that double break at the feet. Oh, there we go. Got it. So yeah, I don't know much about this contest, but I think I might find out. I like I said, I love a good par three course. They're always fun to play to, especially when they they look like this. Like it looks just it looks so natural. It's a beautiful looking course. All the different types of grass and plants that he's used. Love the colours. All right, um, three miles going with us on this one. We've got one hundred and five yards. Alright, let's take the sandwich. Bit of high loft, bit of backspin. And a little fast again. I <laughs> just can't seem to slow it down tonight. Don't know if it's because I'm downloading um, Serious Sam 4 as well, so and that came out on the Xbox Game Pass, so downloading that. Been playing a little bit of um, Halo Infinite. That's not bad, actually. Quite, I'm really enjoying the campaign of that. Do love a good old Halo game. Kind of feels like one of the old games, but a bit more open world too, so it's pretty cool. Well, let's tap this down here. Nice little tap in. Yeah, I think I might, um, like I said, just find a few more of these courses and throw them in here and there. See how many um, courses are in the contest, actually. Oh, wow, look at this one. That is a very nice looking hole. Uh, what are we up to? Hole 7. 134 yards, 21 feet up. Uh, 21 feet, so uh, yeah, maybe coming in with a 99 actually. I'll just put a bit of high loft on it, see if we can slow it up a bit. A bit of backspin. Oh, now I'm getting slow. I've slowed it down way too much for swing. Well, not way too much, but. Still kind of overcooked it. That's going to leave us with one hell of a putt. Oh, that's um, up to downhill again. Breaking left to... Um, sorry, right to left. Alright, what are we going to do here? Oh, I'm going to say about there. Take just. Oh no, I won't take any power out of it. The green speed. Alright, here we go. Oh, just on the inside. Ooh, could have taken a little bit of power out of that one. It would have broken a lot harder though, especially where I had it aimed at. Oh, pick up the par though. Can't argue with that. Okay, moving on to hole 8. Uh, what have we got here? 274 yards, 55 feet down on this one. Okay. Yeah, let's send this with the hybrid. If we can get this to funnel around towards the hole. Nailed it with the perfect as well. Well, this might not be too bad. This needs to get up and roll. Oh, it's coming around beautifully. Oh, here we go, here we go. Is this the hole in one? Oh, it's not going to come back. Oh, not a bad shot, though. Lovely green sculpting. Especially for a par three course. You can see where it all funnels down. you got your choices to come into the green however you want. Oh, it's going to scrape in. 
Nicely done. All right, six under after eight. Okay, hole nine. Uh, what have we got here? 197, 28 feet down. And the five mile wind's gonna help us get there a little bit. 28 feet down, that's that's probably a five. What's the, the front look like down here? Kind of a, can we, a five mile wind. I think I'm gonna. I think a six. Maybe a six. Oh yeah, it's definitely a six. Okay, that's not too bad. That should come around. Oh no, it didn't. I thought it was gonna come around a little bit there. Nice little downhill part. Yeah, oh shit, that's not going to break. <laughs> oh, I hate it when I do that. That f I, I tried to hit it that first back. Like when I pulled back the first time, I tried to hit it. Uh, and went, yeah, if it doesn't work after a few times, it, yeah, it all goes wrong. Um, okay, well, what do we got here? Hole 10, 211 yards, 59 feet down. 59 feet down. Oh, what do we do here? 80-ish, oh, probably the 5-iron. That should come around nicely, roll around. See if we can play to the wind here. See if the wind's going to help me out a bit. 7 mile winds. Oh, now the perfect, now I want it. That's it, start dropping, start dropping. I want it to turn a bit to the left, that's it. Oh, not bad. Possibly even drop down another club, maybe a little bit of lower floor on it. Wow, what a view off in the distance. He's done a sm uh, absolutely smashing job in the planning of this course. Okay, lob wedge ship. Let's put that one, oh, it's a slight uphill. Bring it a little bit closer to it. Oh, there it is, center of the cup. Alright, seven under. Not too bad. Not too bad. Oh, we don't need to see that, do we? That's just a everyday little chip in for me. <laughs> no. I do like my chips though. I do like chipping. Sometimes I'll um, purposely aim for the outer edge of the green so I can chip it on into the hole. Or try anyway. Okay, hole 11. Uh, what do we got? 161, 48 up. Four miles coming at us. 48 up. Let's, um,. Jump that up to the five. I'm gonna put a little bit of high loft on it. That wind's kind of straight at us, so I'm gonna play straight at the pin on this one. Oh, that was a dead straight swing. Oh, sh hit the pin. Oh, it's gonna. No, it's coming back. Oh, here we go. Oh no, <laughs> no, it's just teasing me. Alright, um, well that's a downhill part, let's take some power out of this one. Nice little break at the end there. Oh, and it just funneled down nicely. Okay, hole 12, let's do it. Uh, what do we got here? 169 yards, two feet up, five miles. Still haven't got that birdie yet. I mean, the not the birdie, sorry. The um, oh, look at that. The smokestacks in the distance here, you can see off the tee. Very nice. The um, uh, holy one, sorry. That total mind blank. I'm just looking at the whole planting and everything. It's just yeah, pretty beautiful. Um, all right, so, um, seven on? Yeah, possibly with that wind. Only four mile breeze, but I'm gonna try and use the break on the green here. Or just play straight at it. <laughs> uh, 
Okay, not too bad. Let's go. Oh, I hit that a little firm, that one. Alright, end up picking up a par. I'll tell you what, the absolutely stunning views on this course, just the way he's done it. I think I'm definitely going to have to check out a few more of these par 3 courses. Alright, what do we got? Uh, hole 13, 175, 48 up. 4 miles coming to add us, 48 up. I might play the 5 into this. I think I need more. I wonder if the five's gonna roll up for me. Oh yeah, that's coming in. Oh, slow. Is it gonna slow down nicely? Oh, not a bad shot. Oh, and I've just missed that one too. Oh my god. Short little knee knocking putts get me. The last puckers. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's, uh, what about 14th? 206, 49 down. Now, so three miles slightly going with us. Let's um, bump that back. Oh, I might even try and come in with a six. We can roll it down off here. Oh, I'll slide a little faster. That's going to stay out there. I'm hoping this is going to catch the slope. I'm hoping it's not too long. Come on, get there, get there. Get to the slope. Get to the slope. Here it is. Oh, just a little long. But I got, I got it to do what I wanted it to. So I caught the slope, but <laughs> just needed to drop a little bit earlier. Alright, oh, lob wedge chip. That's, that's in the thick. Uphill. Let's crease that right up here. We're just going to play for that. Get that perfect. There it is. Alright, bring on, oh no, we're going to do a replay. We're going to do a replay. <laughs> um, I think i really got to turn them off because I don't like how it does a replay just on the short little chips on the green. I understand why they do it, but yeah. Alright, uh, hole 15. What have we got? 209, 40 feet down. Smashing view again. Look at those nice little, he's, got the, he's, actually, he's planted it beautifully. You can probably see the zigzag through there then. With the uh, it's got the pathway sort of where you'd walk down to the green. Very nicely done. Um, all right, forty feet down. I think I might come in with the six again. Yeah, that little bit of wind on this one. Oh, that's way short. Shit, what was I thinking on that one? That was way short. Well, that was a brain fart and a half, wasn't it? A lot of pitch. Oh, it almost kicked back towards the hole then. Alright, settle for a par. After that, yeah. I don't know what happened on that. I'm thinking straight anyway. Uh, okay, hole 16, par 3. <laughs> Don't know why I said par 3. Uh, what do we got? 139, 19 feet up. We've got 7 mile winds coming at us on this one. Ooh, this might be a bit of a doozy. Jump up a club here, 8 iron. 7 miles. No, I'm going to take, I'm going to take the 9 into this. Got a little bit of low off to it. See if we can punch through that window just that little bit. Of 
put all your slow. Just need to get all the, the distance. Might not be too bad if that sits down. Okay, that's not bad. I'm happy with that. That's just the putting. He's in. That's in. Well, definitely won't be scoring 18 under. I can tell you that now. Okay. <laughs> oh, 17. Currently 10 under. Um, 159 yards, 9 feet up. So if you're playing along with me, let us know how you went in the comments. Um, yeah, I'm interested to know what you scored. All right, eight miles going with us. Haven't hit a bunker today, which is awesome. 159. Eight miles going with us. Do I bump it back to the nine here? Oh, Miles is going to give us a nice little push. This could be the number. This could be the number. Oh, not bad. Not a bad shot. Oh, wow! How did that break so... What the... F Fuck happened there? You see that turn? I didn't even slice my putt. I know I moved it out a little bit just to, for that break of my feet, but that was ridiculous. All right, hole 18, lucky last. Last chance to get a hole in one. Oh, what a nice little uphill 18th hole too. 53 feet up. That's 171 yards, 53 feet up. That is... That is very nice. This has been a very nice looking course. Very nice little par 3 course. Alright, 53 up. Let's chuck another couple. Let's chuck a couple of clubs at that. Ninety, so 80, 90. Five line's going to kick up a bit. I think I might take the five. Seven mile wins. Hoping the, I'm hoping the five's going to get up there. Oh, fast. Yeah, she's up there. Coming in nice. Little hot, though. That needed some, that needed some high loft. Oh, nasty little downhill part. You know, that break right at the feet, and that's moving, too. And how much of that's going to play? Oh, a lot. That play... Oh, no, it's come back! Came back to the hole, nailed it for a birdie. So that puts us 11 under. Wow, that was a very nice course. I really enjoyed that. It had that beautiful view of every hole because you just sort of had the the green was just on the, the side of the hill every time. It was very nice. All right, again, that was Aspen Villa short course. And again, designed by Mayday91283 for the Victory Wind, Victory Wind Sports par 3 perfection contest so yeah i'll try and find a few more of them for you if you enjoy it because i really do i love a good par 3 course but anyway for me get your balls out of the rough and yeah i'll catch you next time later